Have you noticed how when you start to take an interest in something, you get um, Instagram, maybe, or Facebook recommending stuff based on that? And I am now surrounded by like self-help gurus and all this kind of motivational stuff. It just keeps popping up in my various timelines and stuff. And, you know, some of it I like, some of it I don't like. But a lot of it is all about basing your identity on other people. There's all this kind of stuff like... Um, you know, when times are hard, it's it's then that you really know who your friends are. Or, you know, it's okay for you to literally remove toxic people from your life. Or, you know, it's all putting yourself in the context of other people. I wrote about this in my first book, um, Do the Thing, Have the Power. And I agree with it. Sure, it's, it's you know, th these things are fantastic. But really, when you want to develop, we need to stop having so much reliance or so much context based on other people because the strength needs to come from in here so uh, one of the big things for me was uh, a little mantra that I made up and it was a bit of a game changer for me but it's about not being emotionally dependent on the actions of other people you know and it's actually quite liberating because if someone unsubscribes from my newsletter someone I thought was a friend you know that's absolutely fine because it's you know, it's not for them, it's not their cup of tea, or if someone doesn't want to come to my party, or if someone, you know, can't make lunch, or, you know, all this kind of stuff, it's fine, it's absolutely fine, because it's about them, that's their life. Whereas my life is about me, and this is all I can control, what's going on here, what's going on with my actions all around me, these are the things that I should really focus my attention on, and that's where this kind of good living, and slowing down, and being, kind of living with intention, and being, um, being aware of, of who we are and what we are, we can control this. We're not trying to second guess other people. We're not trying to kind of read between the lines or anything. If people want to be straight up and they don't want to, you know, for example, if someone unsubscribes from these videos, these things that I do, it's absolutely fine because it's not for them. It's not their cup of tea. It's absolutely brilliant. But we've got to stop basing our well being on the actions of other people. It's not about them at all. You know, if people get sick of hearing you complaining all the time, then that's absolutely fine because, you know, it might not be fun to be around, for example. And, you know, it's not about like, well, you know who your friends are when times are tough. It's about understanding that everyone else has got their own shit going on. You know, that everyone's busy. Everyone has got their hands full. Everyone is trying to, like, make the most of this life. And sometimes it can be tough. You know that. They know that. And if we start to respect each other's you know, the struggles that we're going through, all this kind of stuff, then we would be less critical of people when they're not necessarily there for us. Because really the only people who need to be there for us is us. And when we realise that we have the power in here to make all the difference in our lives, then we would stop living in the context of other people. It's not about them. It's not about their actions. It's about our actions. And it's about how we can let go of needing them to validate us to be in our lives to constantly be supporting us you know we need to support ourselves and we can support ourselves and we just need to find that strength and just break free from this reliance on other people one whatever that might be sometimes we get a kick out of you know well you know so and so has not been a great friend so I'm going to get a kick out of like cutting that off you know well so and so might have been going through a lot of shit themselves and, you know, we need to just act with a bit more compassion to others. Whatever they want to do, let them do that. But we can stay in our own lane. We can focus on our own well-being and our own happiness and our own um, sense of worth. We don't need the world around us to give that to us. All right, so it's kind of rambling message there, but I hope you get what I'm talking about. It's about just focusing on yourself, not requiring other people to be or do or you know, act in a certain way in order for us to be emotionally stable and strong and satisfied and content. You know, your emotional well-being should not be based on the actions of other people. All right, cheers for that.